Hi, I'm Annie, your art supervisor, talking with you today from the Community Art Center Clay Studio, housed in the historic hydroelectric plant on 6th Street. We're part of Parks and Recreation. Our aim here is to serve all citizens with opportunities that increase our quality of life uh, through the best arts and cultural programming we can offer. As I reflect on the past year, I'm remembering all the amazing people that have not only made Glenwood Springs and the Community Arts Center amazing places to be, but who are so passionate about art and really dedicated to helping the arts thrive. One such group is the city's Arts and Culture Board. Did you know that this group volunteers behind the scenes to advance art? For instance, this group helped to create the city's public art plan. And this is a framework that will guide how we expand art in Glenwood Springs over time. The board also helped us with the Better Together mural project by formulating and jurying our latest call for artists. And the board this year will aid our staff in creating a public art maintenance plan. It's so important to us to take care of the beautiful public art that we have and that we enjoy every day. So the Arts and Culture Board also wants you to know that they are here for you and they want to connect. The board meets every third Tuesday of the month at the Community Arts Center and the public is welcome to attend. I want you to know how committed I am to supporting the artists and creatives in our community. New this year, the nonprofit Bristlecone Arts Collaborative and local art teachers from three elementary schools will be presenting a fifth grade art show. Over 200 works of art will be on the wall. Please come down to admire and celebrate the work of these talented young artists. I am so excited for 2023. This is going to be the most vibrant year the Community Arts Center has ever seen. For more information on our programs and how to participate, please visit glenwoodrec.com.